Record coloring is a premium feature that allows you to color code your records. This is useful if you want to flag records that meet certain criteria. For example, it's easy to mark tasks according to their status, or if they're overdue. You can apply record coloring to calendar views, grid views, Kanban views, and gallery views. To apply record coloring, open the color menu in the view bar. As you can see, there are multiple ways to apply color to a view. First off, you can color code a record based on its information in a select field. So, for example, if I have a select field denoting different statuses, I can color code each record based on the color of its current status. And if I change this status, the record's color will automatically update. You can also color code records based on a set of conditions. So if a record's due date has already passed and its status isn't yet marked as done, you can assign it a color of your choice. With color coding, everyone can discern which tasks need immediate attention at a glance. In the calendar view, you have the additional option to color code according to date fields. If you have more than one date field for a record, say a draft due date and a publication date, you can assign each one a different color to differentiate between them on your calendar. Record coloring is applied at the view level, meaning that each different view can have its own unique record coloring configuration. However, if you'd like to copy one view's color configuration to another, simply navigate to the view you'd like to color code open its settings, and select the option to copy another view's configuration. From there, you can select the appropriate view, enable the color option, and copy this configuration. I hope that was helpful! If you have any questions, don't hesitate to check out our support articles, visit the community forum, or write to us directly. Thanks for watching!